I don't know if this is working. Go, 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 go! <laughs> go! No! Oh my god. No. What is going on here? Hey, what's going on? I hope you're having a shit one. Yes, I have glasses on. I don't need glasses, but these are actually blue light glasses. Apparently it helps block the blue light out of your screen so you can sleep better at night, which I personally think is a load of shit. But I'm gonna test it out anyway, and in a couple of weeks, I'll let you know how I go. Anyway, you know what? These are actually just fucking annoying. I'm just gonna take them off. <laughs> Got a bit of a special one for you today. So I invited my good friend Hayden down for this video and he's gonna be using a brand spanking new A7R5 with the lens of his choice. And I will be using this old Pentax camera. By the way, Oh, I've got two A7R5s that I will be giving away at the end of this video. Plus, comes with a bag of goodies from Sigma. Make sure you stick around to the end of the video to find out how you can enter to win. Look at that. What a car. I actually don't know anything about cars, but I think it's pretty cool. I actually haven't shot a car before. This will be really interesting. Mike has been shooting cars ever since he was negative one year old, so. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. Spectacular. <laughs> Spectacular. Only JPEGs. I have 12 megapixels. A7R5, 64. Pretty sure it has 64. I'll have yeah. to double check that though. Something like Let's flip a coin. One of my favorite things about Japan is their coins, especially their 500 yen coins. So, okay. <laughs> good, good flip. Okay, you first. <laughs> Wait, should Hayden be allowed to watch you take photos? Oh, it doesn't really matter. This fucking shit. <laughs> you know what? You're a good friend. Thanks for that. They're gonna fuck him up. $50 camera right here. It's all I need. Three, two, one, go. Okay, Nico, can we move the car? Just um, in front of this puddle here. Keep coming. All right, just stay there, Nico. Oh my God. All right, this is where it's gonna get interesting. Oh my God. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Look. It's already fucking cool. It's not too bad. I'm underexposing the images on purpose. Usually you can work with shadows better than you can with highlights. Mike is just like, like he's he's shooting with like a really shitty old camera, but his confidence is scaring me. <laughs> yep, come out of breath. We gotta use this thing. Are you serious? Alright, that's bullshit. Keep it on the line here. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Turn the wheel this way. Yep. Perfect. Five, four, three, two, uh, one. No, this shit's fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I actually think I got some decent ones. That's cool from that angle. Damn. Wow. Dude, that For actually... a tiny little, are you manually controlling the yeah, exposure yeah. on this? <laughs> yeah. Can no, I see it? Can I see it? Oh. That's actually really decent, considering like you only had yeah. 10 minutes to compose all of these shots. Hayden's <laughs> fucked. <laughs> Three, two, one, begin. Okay, all right, so, um, fuck. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of negative space here, but. Uh, so like this, <laughs> like fuck. They're like that, yeah, 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 now back. Yeah, just keep the car there. I wanna shoot through some stuff so we can get some depth. Oh yeah, that could be cool. It's shocking, 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 shocking. Nah, shocking. Shocking. Um, Keep going. Yeah, keep going, keep going. I kind of like want to use this to frame it, but it just, it's not very symmetrical. It's a bit like whack. Uh -oh. Actually, yeah, just stay there, Nico. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, I just wish I could stand back more, but there's a wall here. Can you, oh wait, one sec. I just, I'll just take a photo like that. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> I'm like looking for symmetry, but it just looks jank. I don't have like a proper vision. Whereas I feel like Mike would have like a really like good idea as to what he wants. Fuck, a lot of my shots are just random, you know? Three, we gotta get this two, one. No, one. No, that's no, I think it. I, got, I might have gotten it. These are really, really bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, brother, have faith. Okay, so that's all right. <laughs> Keep scrolling, bro. <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing, you know what I mean? Like. Three, two, one, whoop. All right, sweet. Can we actually back it up a bit more? This camera, bro, it like has these purple lines that come through it. Dude, I'm shooting long exposures on this little thing. Oh my God. 
Oh, far out. I'm not working with very much here, boys. I hope this is working. I'm shooting four second exposures. It reckons this camera's got a 2.8 aperture at 50 ISO. Three, two, one. Hey. <laughs> the best sound in the world. I wasn't touching it, but it took the photo. Three, two, one. Let's go. Wait, can I get your assistance or is that illegal? I need the tripod. Okay, I got Fuck this you, mate. Oh. <laughs> I asked oh. you if you want to do this before. I thought we weren't allowed to. Two and a half minutes. You're kidding. Oh God. Does this even go any higher? Nico, when I say go, straight forward and then swerve around and then just go around. Right, three, two, one, go. Go, 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 go. Oh, you stole it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. 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 <laughs> What do you mean? <laughs> All right, wait, 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 wait. He how, stole how, them. How much time do we have? How much? 20 Turn seconds. Turn wait, 20 seconds? <laughs> 14 now. No, I don't have enough time. 10. We can do a Hail Mary. All right, wait. All right, Two. go now. Go, 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 go. Go. <laughs> go. Yeah. <laughs> you just got it. He just oh got my it. god. So he's going now. You're crazy, man. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do you want to review it? No! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Fuck, what do you mean? Last location. You ready? I'm ready. In three, two, one, let's go. Why is this fat pole in the way? Okay, Nico, can you? I've actually been shooting a lot of the back of the car. Can you put down your, your window? Yeah, yeah, sorry, down. Okay. Now I'm starting to think like North Borders. Three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> I got some variety, I suppose. Three, oh, two, shit. one, now. All right, Nico, can we back it out and then reverse it back in? Oh, what is going on? My focus what? settings. What is this? It's not focusing. 15 seconds. No, what is going on here? Oh, only one angle. Two, one, zero. Oh, oh yeah. Nice, okay. <laughs> What happened? The focus was set to macro, so it was only focusing on the foreground. I did manage to get one, but it's definitely not the best shot. Oh, I would have loved to have been able to do something different. Fuck. All right, here we are. All edited up, ready to have a look at each other's photos. How much is your camera worth? $5,000, roughly. So remember the camera I'm shooting on is 12 megapixels and about 17 years old. So your photos better be worse than mine, otherwise <laughs> I, I have to quit photography. <laughs> yeah, first location we went to, not much else to say. Oh yeah, it's all right. Nice. Why are you smirking like that? <laughs> <laughs> like I was going for that like yeah, silhouette yeah, no, kind of like think dark. It, I think it looks great actually. I think it's a pretty decent shot. Can I have a look at, is it landscape or portrait? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is a portrait. <laughs> I probably would have shot that landscape because it, there's a lot of negative yeah, space. Yeah, you have a lot of negative space in it. So a lot of negative you space. You could have even cropped it like sort of almost two by one. I think almost a green matrix sort of tint would have looked really nice. In the nice. shadows? Yeah, it would have looked really yeah, nice I agree. on that personally. And that quality, man. Yeah, the quality is insane. <laughs> Something I had very little of. Like, That's a very nice shot. Just kind of like composing it with that fence thingy. And there's this one oh. as well. The just wheels like, turn the wrong way. Oh, is it? <laughs> I, I always get it wrong. You never want to see tire. So first up, I used the reflection. So that was the before. Oh. And then I managed to edit it like No that. fucking <laughs> way. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> that is fucked, bro. <laughs> I can't believe that. Oh, now I, no, that's great. That is really cool. And that's a JPEG that you edited. Yeah, I had to edit JPEGs. This little camera does not shoot RAWs. And then next up, I jumped up onto that thing and I got this shot oh here. Oh my God, which okay. I'm happy with. That's insane. Oh my God. This car is so nice as well because it's got such a beautiful silhouette to it. You're using the lines 
to kind of like draw attention to the subject being the car. Yeah. And I like how you literally, for this shot, you had to like jump up on that thing <laughs> and like just like scoot across a little bit just to get this angle. Yeah. And it just goes to show that like shooting from different angles really does make the photo feel and look, look a lot different. Shooting above cars is very underrated and I think more people should do it. Everything screwed up when I tried oh, taking yeah. this shot. I ended up photoshopping it a little bit. Okay. And I got this. Oh, that's amazing, bro. It's all right. That's very good, actually. Like if the tripod was higher, I think it would be better because you would be able to see the trails like more. Yeah, and but it would have been right. nice to get, have another uh, go to get more like equal length of the lines because it, it sort of comes out a bit more on that yeah, side. Yeah, I know, we had to resize it and shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dude, that's amazing. What a shot. Like your really reaction dang. to this, <laughs> I was expecting this to look a lot worse. So yeah, that's incredible, man. Well done. I got this shot. Oh, nice. Okay, I that's that's cool. I think you got a nice balance between, yeah, you got the background and the car. There is a lot of negative space in the top left. That's the only thing that I would say. What I was mainly trying for this image is this high barrier here, I, was, I had the tripod just up enough. I probably could have gone a bit higher to frame the car within the barrier, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. So the road, the barrier, and then you have the city skyline. Final location. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I did it. I barely even got the car in the frame. Yeah, yeah, okay. We had two minutes for yeah, this yeah, shot, yeah, all right? It was a quick shot. I, and like of the ones I looked at, I'm like, this one's the best and it's just the worst. Yeah. <laughs> it is what it is. I think you could have gone a bit lower. This middle section with all that it's glass. It's ugly as shit. Yeah, it's very ugly and my eye goes straight there. Sort of like, although that's the true. car's awesome, but it's like, what what is going on back yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, it's like, that's just wasted, shitty space. Yeah, but yeah. the lighting in that spot, like, basically did all the work for us. To, like, oh, waste. you're fucking kidding me, dude. <laughs> that is like, you see, I actually thought that this was going to be, like, blurry. Yeah, I managed in the last couple of seconds to get a, a shot that was in focus. Okay, to be honest, that one is either my second favorite or my favorite one that you've actually shot from this shoot. Really? Yeah, because I, yeah, I, I love the pillars. Yeah, the pillars is what I really wanted to use. Yeah. And I've actually always wanted to shoot an Aston Martin at this location because this is not far from my house. And I've always driven past it and thought this would suit a silver car, specifically an Aston. Too bad I have to shoot on a shitty tax. <laughs> but I saw this angle. Oh, which I nice. Wanted to shoot. Yeah, yeah, you shot and it I, through the thing. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that is a cool shot. And I thought that worked out really nicely. Yeah, like frames it between the reflections. Yeah, I like that. That's it. That's it? Good game. Good game. Well done. Okay, oh. so, Lamont. You got, I'd say, six and a half out of ten. Nice. I'm happy with that. And Pretty Mike, good. I reckon you got. An eight and a half out of ten. Whoa, That's good. Right. I'm happy yeah. with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done. So, what do you think of the photos? Who do you think deserves to win? Leave it down in the comments. Now it's time to go to Studio Mike, talk about this giveaway. Thanks, Mike. So, let's have a look at what you can win. We've got a Sony A7R5 from me, a Sigma 35mm f1.4, a 64 gigabyte Extreme Pro SD, a circular polarizer, and a UV filter from Hoya. Both of these prizes are identical, but there are two different ways to enter. One is a photography competition slash giveaway, and the other one is a raffle. Let's talk about the photography competition first. The theme of this competition is life in 2050. Futuristic, dystopian, fantasy, creative, along those sort of lines. I'll be marking the photos on originality, emotion, relation to the theme, and photographic aspects. How is the lighting in the photo? Is the photo in focus? Those sort of things. There will be a Google form link for you to upload your photos to. Entries will close on the 7th of June. So don't worry, you've got plenty of time. It's pretty much a month to get your shit together. I'll be going through each photo, then I'll be choosing a top nine, so my nine favorite photos, which I'll then put up on my Instagram story on the 9th of June. The photos will go up for everyone to vote, photo battle style, and then whichever photo gets the most amount of votes, will win. So make sure you're following me at North Borders so you don't miss out. Okay, the rules. No 3D. No 3D rendering is allowed for this competition. This is pure photography skill only. I will only allow small Photoshop adjustments. No old photos. If you win this competition, you might be asked by me to prove that you took this photo within the month time frame that I've given you. This is about you going out and taking photos. That's what this competition is about. You must be subscribed to my channel and be following Sigma Photo Australia on Instagram. Okay, 
So that's one way to enter. Let's talk about the raffle. Raffle's pretty simple. If you own my presets, V1, V2, V3, or any combo pack, if you've bought presets from any of my websites, you are already in the running. If you'd like to get a ticket to enter slash preset pack, buying a preset pack from one of my sites will automatically give you a ticket. So if you still would like to enter, you have until the same amount of time, 7th of June when the photo competition ends, and then I'll be sharing the raffle winner on the 10th of June. Them the rules, boys and girls. That is everything. Good luck, happy shooting, keep having yourself a shit one, and I will see you in the next one. Mike has shot here before. No comment. Saved by two words. You've shot here though. I've never been like here. A little shit. Trying to make things. I'm up. from Warwick. <laughs> <laughs>